Okay, we've installed uh, Antegos GNOME and we're gonna look in some detail into the extensions. So, May tweak, first that. May tweak extensions. One of the things that's available is this dash to dock. We uh, think that's normal, but no, it's actually an extension. And extensions can be changed if you have this little icon here beneath it or behind it. And let's go ahead and change some stuff around. That's that. You can check for intelligent height if you don't want to hide it. Or you can change some settings here as well. Reset to default if you think you did something wrong. Yeah. So, what should we do with this dock? It's all up to you if you want to auto hide it or not. <coughs> the size of the thing, you should you change the size. Panel mode, do you like it better like that? Or do you say, I like my icons to be a bit smaller because I have a lot of icons. I want to have more icons from here till here. Then maybe you have to make your icons a bit smaller. Yeah, it's up to you. Fix icon size, scroll to reveal other icons. All possibilities and it's not finished. You have four more tablets or tabs, three tabs more. Show the favorite applications. Show open windows previews if something is open. You can check a preview like for instance this man maybe. We just see terminal now. Show open windows previews would have shown normally I think something but I guess it will not show anything right now. Show applications icons. Use hotkeys, click action, cycle through windows. When you click on this thing here, should we cycle through windows if we scroll over it? If we have more multiple scroll over, and then you can cycle through the windows for instance. Click action, cycle through windows, so both of them is maybe not a good idea. Do nothing them. And appearance, use built-in team. I think this is actually worse this is the arc theme color but if in doubt you can customize the dash color here as well and say i want to have it all red select and then it's red the counter indicators shrink the dash to save some space make it smaller this one of course i like i was looking for opacity in my theme and we can make it more and more opaque so that's quite nice that we can do this one. So I'm going to keep it like this. And that's just one of our extensions. And we've done a few, we saw this one in another tutorial, I'm not going over that again. That was a nice one to make a desktop customization. And then you have to go to get more extensions. We're sent to GNOME extensions which is just fine. Best to make a login, I did anyway, but it's not necessary. And what can you do now? You can check out installed extensions. Let's do this first. And it says, click here to install the browser extension. So we did not, do not have it. So we allow and remember to install here this little program, extensions gnome.org install it has been installed successfully so what are my extensions these are all my extensions and this one is on this one is off and here are the settings application the dash to dock we just went inside of it if we click here that's what we did so i must congratulate the guys from gnome this is rather neat you go to a website, you see an extension that you like, and now we're going to look for extensions by name, by recent, by downloads, by popularity, compatible with current version, yes please. So these are the things by popularity, 
and we can go over them and see things we like if we have something about open weather want to see the weather you can do so disconnect wi-fi wi-fi we have to say and caffeine just to disable the screensaver auto suspend so it's always on caffeine you know keeping it awake so you can go over elements that we like but of course it's a lot of pages and you can also type transparent for instance if we are thinking about how and what can we make transparent this glassy gnome is for instance one of the things I rather like glassy gnome we can say okay let's put it on download and install the glassy gnome yes please something happened here something happened here as you can see we have here a special kind of look now and we should check out maybe with to close it again user themes let's close it and see if glassy gnome is now somewhere in there extension here it is unfortunately there are always some things you would like to change and there is no button here so don't know i can here to go further down and then change some some things the way you want but this is what classic gnome looks like so you can check out google and type in what are the best gnome extensions and the ones you like you can get them for instance um, you are a downloader and you want to have net speed but let's do it in gnome as well here not somewhere else so extensions in this one net speed maybe it's one word probably it's one word uh, yeah, let's take a guess yep i think it's that one so displays the internet speed if you want to know information when you download stuff then you see here this information as you see device down and so on that's my name i suppose at the moment in this system so that's my ethernet card and so you can keep looking for extensions that you want about the weather about the music about spotify for instance just the idea just keep popped up since you know that i'm paying for it do i have something for the system for spotify but i guess not nothing's coming out of here might be possible that i have to type something about music or so but if nothing is there nothing is there it's as simple as that i don't think i did i made a mistake or anything so you can go over all these pages there are a lot of pages so let's take a look see if we can know how many pages there are 19 okay 19 pages system monitor display system information you check it out by clicking it and you get this page and you say look at let the picture is this the what i want to have yeah that's that's probably what i need so just click it here and then it's installed so it's about up to you a, a bit um, what are your uh, interests what are your focus points what do you want to see in your system and what um, is available what extensions do we have that's up to you to figure it out anyway enjoy the extensions